Well, I left Kentucky back in 49, went to Detroit working on the assembly line. The first year they haven't put wheels on Cadillac. Every day I'd watch them beauties roll by, and sometimes I'd hang my head and cry, cause I'd always wanted me one that was long and black. One day I'd advise myself a plan that should be the envy of most any man. I'd sneak it out of there in a lunchbox in my hand. Now I'm getting called, men getting fired, but I figured I'd have it all by the time I retired. I'd have me a car worth at least a hundred grand. I get it one piece at a time, and it wouldn't cost me a dime. You'll know it's me when I come through your town. I'm gonna ride around in style, I'm gonna drive everybody wild, because I'll have the only one there is around. So the very next day when I punched in with my big lunchbox with help from my friends, I left that day with a lunchbox full of years. I've never considered myself a thief, but GM wouldn't miss just one little piece, especially if I strung it out over several years. The first day I got me a fuel pump, and the next day I got me an engine and a trunk, and I got me a transmission and all the chrome. The little things I can get in my big punch box, like nuts and bolts and all four shocks, with the big stuff I stuck out my buddy's mobile. Home. Now up to now, my plan went all right until we tried to put it all together one night and that's when we noticed that something was definitely wrong. The transmission was a 53 and the motor turned out to be a 73 when we tried to put in the bolts, all the holes were gone. So we drilled it out so that it would fit with a little bit of help from an adapter kit. We had that engine run just like a song. Now the headlight was another side. We had two on the left and one on the right. When we pulled out the switch, all three of them come on. The back end looked kind of funny too, but we put it together and when we got through, well that's when we noticed that we only had one tail fin. About that time my wife walked out and I could tell in her eyes that she had her doubts, but she opened the door and said, honey, take me for a spin. So we drove uptown just to get the tags and I headed right down on Bay Drag. You could hear everybody laughing miles around. But at the courthouse I didn't laugh because I type it up and took the whole staff and by the end the title weighed 60 pounds. I got it one piece at a time and it didn't cost me a dime. You'll know it's me when I come through your town. I'm gonna ride around in style, I'm gonna drive everybody wild, because I'll have the only